Boromir, a noble warrior of kingly bearing and one of the Fellowship of the Ring, convinced himself that possession of the One Ring would restore his kingdom. When he demanded it, Frodo refused him and in fright put it on. The Fellowship sent out search parties to find the now invisible Hobbit, during which Merry and Pippin were attacked by orcs and Boromir came to their rescue and despite killing a large number of their assailants, was pierced with many arrows and slain. Aragorn, after he heard a thunderous blast from Boromir's great horn of Gondor, rushed to his rescue, only to find he was too late. Aragorn, Legolas and Gimli set Boromir's body with his weapons and those of the orcs that he had killed in a boat. They launched him towards the falls of Rauros, so that the river and Duin would honourably bury him. The River Anduin began its long journey between the Misty Mountains and the Grey Mountains. It was the longest river in the Middle Earth, 1,388 miles long. And here in the north, in ancient times, the One Ring was lost beneath its lucid waters. Lothlorien, the magical forest of the elves, nestled within its widening valley. Onward it flowed through the land of Rowan, beneath the White Mountains, passing the immense walls of Minas Tirith and then at last into the Great Sea.